it makes sense to me that they do good, do, um, do good things for you. Everything has a frequency. If it moves, it's got a vibration, it's got a wavelength, it's got a frequency. Your atoms, every atom, every molecule has got a frequency. So if you have body parts or ailments or whatever that and the frequencies are out of sync, if you can take in some frequencies that um, will smooth out or help whatever, <laughs> normalize, I can see how it could uh, help get you healthy. But yeah, I'm a firm believer in the uh, grounding, getting electrons and the negative ions. Like I said, stuff like this, um, pollution, city living, generates positive ions, they're bad for you, free, free radicals, they'll attach to your cells, give you cancer, lower your immune system, or damage it. Negative ions, electrons will neutralize that, combat the free radicals, create a shield around your cells, preventing the free radicals from attaching. That's grounding and negative ions. And looks like we got our little, well you can't see it, we got to have our little small negative ion generator going down there. Combating all these positive ions that we're getting, that we're breathing in.
85, 10 miles, 75, 14 miles. We'll be going to 75 and doing the you know, farmer's market. So we've got another 14 miles. Hopefully the GoPro won't get hot and cut off. Langford Park. 
Clark Plains, Georgia 166, 154. That is also Lakewood Freeway. That'll take you back to the left and back into Atlanta. To the right or uh, to the west will take you all the way over around Carrollton down south and hit, I think, hit 27, I think. Saturday morning, 8 30. 285 traffic. I'm going to roll the window down and let a little bit of cool air in. Try to keep this GoPro from getting too hot. cuts off and I have to start switching cameras and I start having to piece video together. I wasn't expecting this. I may have, I may have used a different camera. Yeah, because it takes a little bit for it to cool down. So if it cuts off, even if I change the battery out quick, it still takes time to cool down. Speed up the, the video, or you know, take this little scroll bar and scroll through a bunch of this stuff. I don't like doing this kind of video, but then there's a blue light special up there. I guess you should have known that. <laughs> Than fly. 
all my equipment, cameras and everything going, going I, I wouldn't want to check it for baggage and go through the thing. You got to turn everything on, show them that it's, it is what it is, not something goofy. I have no inclination to fly whatsoever. I'd want to go either Birmingham or uh, somewhere in Tennessee, somewhere to catch a plane and head out versus uh, coming to Atlanta. State Patrol, I guess that this is part of the uh, road, road construction here. set concrete. I don't know how long it takes for this to dry and then to open up.
of 75, we may go to Jonesboro Road and then get off, and that way you can go into the farmer's market, the back side, then come back out, and that way we'd be picking up 285. Well, it won't matter. We'll be picking up 285 the same either way.
25. That way this will cool down and we will be able to change your battery. Okay, leaving the farmer's market. We want to get on, uh oh, we ran that red light, didn't we? We want to get on 75 and then 285. Hope that wasn't a law sitting back there. If it was, he got us, because we flat ran that red light. He even got it documented on camera. <laughs> Atlanta Bypass, 285, that's where we're going. We'll be going up the east side. Double back up. We do have 675. 
did, I thought about getting off at Boulder Crest. We could have gone back by the top city. I've got a couple of videos of Top City. Old Atlanta Prison Farm.
get off up here, so we're picking it up right from where we pretty much left off.
top end in this lane.
think the GoPro Black 10 will make it without before it gets hot and cuts off again.
us at exit 296 this morning on 75. We hit our odometer. Let's see how far we've gone.